A formal complaint has been made to the Police Complaints Authority about treatment of residents in 6th Company New Grant on January 10th by members of the Trinidad and Tobago Police Service. Movement for Social Justice leader David Abdullah visited with residents on Sunday to bring them up to speed on actions that have been taken following their protest. He now says that since reports have been made, the police are allegedly harassing residents and is calling for urgent action to be taken. We cannot have a situation where investigations may be taking place and the police officer who is being investigated is still on the job and using or hiding behind the uniform and his power to harass and intimidate residents who have made a complaint against him. That is absolutely unacceptable. Absolutely unacceptable. So we are calling on, on Acting Commissioner Stephen Williams. I think you're on your 12th acting appointment. Well, several villagers were injured when a high-powered hose was used to disperse them during the protests. This is being used as the basis for their case to the PCA. One such resident, Joyce Lynn Neptune, said she had to have surgery for her injuries. The doctor prescribed, sent me to San Fernando Hospital to see her eye doctor, and I went there on Ward 8, and she did give me an exam of my eyes, and she said my eyes, the chlorine from the water, the impact of the water in my eyes caused the eye to inflame information and to bleed. She prescribed me for surgery on the eye the 24th, which is a Wednesday, and they did this. Wednesday of January, and they did the left eye first. So I have to go back within six weeks to do the right. And Ansel Roger is calling on all relevant ministers to pay more attention to the residents of the area. Also speaking on Sunday, he said, it is time for residents in Sixth Company to be given the same respect as other areas in the country. With respect to the roads and the landslides and the water courses and the um, houses that are being eroded as a result of poor drainage and all of those things and treat six company as he would treat all the upscale communities and so on give six company the priority that he would give the cure up interchange and come and treat with the residents in a manner that is befitting of people you are people too and your life and your livelihood matters but it seems that for some people once they are in office who put them in office they don't matter and we have a serious problem with that. 